Hey guys, what is going on? It is Ben from Extraught Collectibles here. So, we're here with a bit of a different video today. As you can tell by the title, it is my PSA submissions for... This will probably be for January, um, but it will most likely go to PSA in kind of like a, a February. So, as you can see, we've got kind of four piles. Um, they're kind of individually sit, split out into uh, kind of bulk, uh, bulk kind of ones and then into individual cards a bit kind of more rarer cards to get and then our kind of higher end cards so what we'll do is i'll just show you all um and then hopefully in however long time we can do the return and then uh and then yeah pretty much i predict at least 99 percent of uh, all these to come back a 10 uh, a 9 slash 10 there's maybe one that we'll get to at the very end of kind of like the higher ranking pile that I expect maybe to get an 8 slash 9 because there's a tiny bit of whitening but we'll do we'll go through the kind of little first pile first and you can see what we've got going on so this kind of pile is pretty much just a lot of bulk bulk cards so the, you know you've got the King Jewish you've got the Dragonites from the Shining Legends uh, pin collections then you get into some uh, Vivid Voltage stamped uh, Snorlaxes that came from the, uh, WHS um, WH Smith, sorry, WH Smith, not WHS. Uh, and then you come into some Grookey on the balls and then Eevee on the balls as well. Um, so obviously they're the foot sale promos. So hopefully when the next lot release come out, then we can grab some more of them. But that is pretty much the first bulk pile. So they're all just a lot of duplicates that we going up on the website that we use for kind of uh, giveaway prizes and, and such. And then we get to a bit more of the, the more interesting pile. So we kind of have a, a few different ones. So we've got our little Mew Hollow there from Evolutions, a nice little team up promo, um, two Japanese Pikachu promos from the little packs that you get. Um, then you go into uh, a nice little Charizard there, and then you go into some amazing rares which are from the shiny V set, uh, the Japanese ones, so the very first uh, shiny, uh, the very first amazing rares that I came out um, for Japanese, I have also got them upgraded, so we're just waiting on them to come back, and then you go into some more, you got another one there, uh, and you go into some more like the shiny V stuff. Uh, from, ja from the Japanese set and then you go into a few Charizards and a few promo Pikachus as well you know we've all got to love a Charizard and got to love a little Pikachu especially with the new Pikachu box coming out uh, next month so what maybe three, three or so weeks away um, and here we go so a bit more of the kind of uh, higher endish type cards so you know we've got a couple of we've got the thick old Pikachu there then we've got a big old Pika there so the Pikachu V, lovely card. You've got a lovely Charizard that we pack pulled uh, the other day, so we're going to be sending that one off as well. And then we've got the uh, Japanese uh, promo Charizard, which is a beautiful looking artwork. Got one of them in there. Then you've got uh, Dragon Majesty, I believe, Charizard. Then you've got, obviously, Darkness Ablaze uh, Charizard. Then you've got two of the standard V Charizards. Um, and then I cannot remember what that set is from, but again, another Charizard. Charizard's always going up in price, so it's always worth kind of getting those ones graded. And then, then you come into some of the some of the bigger boys, you know, some of the bigger ones that you're like, yeah, these are the more of your top end cards. So obviously, um, it, if you've been kind of like following from the, uh, when it came, first came out, the Vivid Voltage set, these Charizards, even just in the sealed packs right now, are going for around 100 to 150 pound. Um, obviously, I've taken mine out. I've uh, I've got one of these in my folder as well to keep for my pre-release sets. But we're also going to be grading mine as well. And then we go into this absolute beauty. So Glaceon Level X. I picked that up today. Um, uh, a decent-ish price for its condition. Condition is absolutely beautiful. I paid £100 for it. So it is a very clean card. No, you can't really see the top corner. But very clean indeed. So that I'm expecting um, a 9. An 8 slash 9. Um, and then we come into the final two cards. Which are the US exclusive delivery uh, special delivery pikachu cards so one of these are absolutely mint um, and the other one's probably around an eight slash nine so these two will be going off express grading uh, as will these two cards as well these will all be going off express um, just to get them back a little bit quicker and then uh and then yeah we'll have another one of these coming as well and then we'll probably um sell one of them just to help cover the fees for for everything we've got here 
but that is my submission. Um, I'll probably try and do a submission maybe once every two months, keeps the kind of recurrence going. I do have a lot of submissions coming back within the next couple of months, so stay tuned, you know, click hit that subscribe button, stay tuned, you can see what we've got. The majority of the cards that do come back will be kind of used as prizes, as I said before, and they also will be used to sell on the website and such like that. So don't forget to head on over to the website, see what we've got available. Um, everything I've got on there, pretty much I will be doing an unboxing for, especially for the sh new Shining Fate set. Um, that'll be one set that I'll be absolutely looking to complete. But thank you very much guys for watching, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.